Miss Niambi Ayana, back with another video. Okay, so I have been thinking about quite a few common money mistakes that you can avoid in your 20s, specifically about apartments today. I remember as I was transitioning into my 20s, my primary focus was independence. After having a messy roommate at the age of 13 in boarding school and some strange roommates when I was traveling abroad, I knew that I was destined to live on my own. So by the time I was 20 years old, I was determined to find my own apartment even if that meant that my pockets would be drained, which is a terrible idea and I do not advise it. So instead, I want to inform you on three reasons why you should try to keep your rent low. So let's get right into this. All right, so the first reason is to eliminate any unnecessary stress. Trying to find yourself and understand who you are as a young adult is already tough enough, especially if you're putting any extra pressure on yourself to be perfect like I used to do. So when you do take the leap and figure out how much you want to spend on rent, ideally, you should spend less than 40% of your income on your rent. That way, you still have enough money for food, bills, hanging out, and your savings. The second reason is to establish healthy budgeting and saving habits. You should absolutely have fun and enjoy every single moment of being in your 20s because it only happens once. However, as I always say, anything can happen. So you should be prepared in the event that you have any car troubles, emergency dental work needs to be done, maybe your working hours are reduced, along with so many other endless scenarios. So you want to ensure that you still have a decent amount of backing in the event that any life changes happen. Finally, the third reason why you should try to keep your rent low is because this is a temporary living situation. You are just starting out and you have time to move into your dream apartment pretty soon. If you have roommates right now, potentially your next apartment that you move into will be just for you. So I say, as long as you are safe and comfortable, try to have your rent as low as possible so that you can save for your next steps in your life. So that is all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And let me know in the comments down below if you have come up with your own game plan as you begin the process of thinking of moving into your own space. Also, if you want any one-on-one -on -one guidance to figure out how much money you can spend on an apartment or just budgeting tips in general, then make sure to schedule a consultation with me. The link will be located in the description box down below, as well as another link so that you can download your own budget input to you. If you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Have any comments, questions, concerns, please leave them down below. You can reach me on all of my social media platforms and make sure to subscribe. Hit that subscribe button and that little bell notification next to it so you'll miss any of my videos ever. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.